Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and today is the feast of the first native North American to be canonized, Kateri Takawitha. Here's what Pope Benedict said about her in his canonization homily on October 21, 2012. Kateri Takawitha was born in today's New York State in 1656 to a Mohawk father and a Christian Algonquin mother who gave to her a sense of the living God. She was baptized at 20 years of age and to escape persecution, she took refuge in St. Francis Xavier Mission near Montreal. There she worked faithful to the traditions of her people, although renouncing their religious convictions, until her death at the age of 24. Leading a simple life, Kateri remained faithful to her love for Jesus, to prayer, and to daily mass. Her greatest wish was to know and to do what pleased God. She lived a life radiant with faith and purity. Kateri impresses us by the action of grace in her life, in spite of the absence of external help, and by the courage of her vocation to virginity, so unusual in her culture. In her, faith and culture enrich each other. May her example help us to live where we are, loving Jesus without denying who we are. St. Kateri, protectress of Canada and the first Native American saint, we entrust to you the renewal of the faith in the First Nations and in all of North America. May God bless the First Nations. Those were Pope Benedict's words, and they are a good reminder to us that every one of us is called to become holy right where we are.